if you want to find out your book profit the procedure is very simple net profit minus interest on capital will be your net profit in case of company there are two taxes will be there one is normal tax one more is dividend distribution tax actual remuneration or standard remuneration whichever is less we are supposed to consider A warm welcome to one and all. This is your Adarsh sir here, lecturing with the Ashram Fazlul College, the Temple of Excellence. Now we are discussing your session nine, unit four of corporate tax planning. In this, we are discussing the topic called tax planning and managerial decisions. So in the previous session, we done with all the topic like make or buy decisions, own or borrowed fund, own or lease fund. Everything we have completed, and in today's session, we will go with topic called firm versus company, partnership firm versus company. So we'll go for your problem number one. The agenda is very simple: firm versus company. In this problem number one, Rama and Lakshmana processed. to set up a business like you are starting a new business now either as a partnership or a private limited you can go for partnership form or you can go for private limited where both the members are shareholders and directors like if you are starting a company you will be called as directors or members if you are starting partnership form you will be called as partners With a capital contribution of ten lakh, even though it is a partnership, even though it is a company, what is your capital investment? Ten lakh. Now, each estimated profit ten lakh each in the sense, if there are two partners are there, first person ten lakh, second person ten lakh. Two directors are there, two members are there, first person ten lakh, second person ten lakh. Now. The estimated profit of the business before charging remuneration is thirty thousand each per month. What is the remuneration? Thirty thousand each per month, and interest twelve percent per annum is eighteen lakh. What is the interest part? Eighteen lakh they are charging now. They decided to distribute the profit or dividend equally. Suggest which form of organization is suitable from the tax point of view. Assume the applicable tax rate for both the firm and the company is thirty-one point two. Even though it is a partnership firm, even though it is a company, what is the tax rate? The tax rate is thirty-one point two percent. Now. So combination of income of firm. What we are doing now, we are comparing partnership is better, our company is better. Now I'll start with partnership firm. We'll calculate complete tax liability for partnership firm. Once you're done with partnership firm, later we'll go for company. Now estimated profit before interest and salary, eighteen lakh. Less interest on partners' capital, it will be ten lakh multiplied with twelve percent. I'll show you. I'll tell you what is the calculation now. First, you have to start with your profit. In the answer only, I'll give you the format. Now, what is your net profit? I'll go back to your question. Your net profit is eighteen lakh. After all the remuneration and everything, what is your net profit? Eighteen lakh. Take eighteen lakh. Done. Then less interest on capital. If you want to find out your book profit, the procedure is very simple. Net profit minus interest on capital will be your net profit. What is the interest actually? Ten lakh is the capital. Interest portion is how much? Remember, twelve percent multiplied with twelve percent. Ten lakh into twelve percent, you will get one lakh twenty thousand. How many partners are there? Two. Again, one lakh twenty thousand because each invested ten lakh. What is your total? The total is two lakh forty thousand. We are done with this. Yes, two lakh forty thousand is your interest. Eighteen lakh minus two lakh forty. Your answer is fifteen lakh sixty thousand. What is this? Your book profit is fifteen lakh sixty thousand. We are done with your book profit. Then. Less remuneration of working partner. Now, actual remuneration is what? Very simple. I'll go back. What is actual remuneration? Anywhere? Yes, 
30,000 per month is the actual remuneration. Now, 30,000, number of partners, 2. Number of months, 12. So, how much it is? 7,20,000. Can we give actual remuneration? No. There are calculations are there. Actual remuneration or standard remuneration. Whichever is less, we are supposed to consider. Remember, actual is how much? 30,000 into 2 partners into 12 months. 7,20,000. Then, or statutory limit. What is the statutory limit? Up to 3,90% above 3,60%. Remember, up to 3,90% above 3,60%. How much is your book profit? 15,60. Up to 3,90%. 3,00 into 90%, you got 2,70. Yes. 15,60 minus 3,00. What is the balance now? 15,60 minus 3 lakh. You may get around 12,60,000. I'll calculate here. 12,60,000 multiplied with 60%. So you get 7,56. Add both. 10,26,000 is your answer. Now, 10,26,000, you got your answer. Hope you are clear. Yes. Now, 7,20 will be actual remuneration. Take your book profit up to 3,90%, above 3,60%. Add both. You get 10,26. In this, whichever is less, 7,20,000 is the less. Whichever is less, 7,20,000 is the less. Take 15,60 minus 7,20, you got 8,40,000. Up to this, any doubt? Hope there is no doubt. Again, I'll explain you. You have to start your problem with what? Net profit. Net profit minus interest on capital. You will get what? Book profit. Book profit minus what? Remuneration. Two, one is actual remuneration. One more is standard remuneration. Whichever is less, you are supposed to minus. You will get your business income. For business income, what you are supposed to do? You are supposed to calculate your taxation. What is the tax? 31.2% given in the question paper. So calculate 31.2, Your final answer. Profit after tax, 5,77,920. Hope you are clear. Yes, this is all about your first step under partnership form. Next, once you're done with your individual calculate, sorry, your overall calculation, now you calculated tax under partnership form, but there are two partners are there. How much tax those are paying? How much tax Ram is paying? How much tax Lakshman is paying? I'll give you a simple example. Myself and one more my friend, XYZ. We both started a business. Under what partnership form? Our income is how much? Our income is 840. Myself and XYZ both started a business. Our income is 840. We have to pay tax how much? 31.2% is our tax. I pay tax. Now, is it enough? No. Later, I should calculate mine and he should calculate his individual tax payable. You should do that. What is the individual tax? I'll show you. There is a Ram and there is a Lakshman. What is my income? My income is, I'll get a remuneration like 30,000 multiplied with 12. My remuneration is 360. My remuneration is 360. I'm getting only salary. No, I'm getting interest also. 120,000, 120. My total income is 480. Am I getting only 480? Yes. So for that 480, calculate tax up to 250. No tax. So uh, remaining is how much? 230. On 230, 5 percent. Because up to 5 lakh tax rate is only 5 percent. 11,960, 11,960. Now, add education says after adding everything, you got 11,960, 11,960. Now, 480,000 minus 11,960, 480 minus 11,960.
960. How much you got? 468. This is your income, personal income. Along with personal income, I'll go back. 577920 is there. This is your business income. This belongs to whom? Myself and XYZ. Similarly, divided by 2. See, 577920 divided by 2, you will get 288. 2 lakh 80. Your final answer is individual income you calculate. Once you're done with your individual income, please calculate the business income divided by 2. It will be distributed to both the members, both the partners. Hope you are done with your partnership form. Now I'll go to company. Computation of income of company. Now I am in the second step. Second step is simple compared to your first step. Now same procedure, what is your net profit? 18 lakh. What is your salary? 7 lakh 20. 18 minus 7 lakh 20, 10 lakh 80. In this, the same procedure will do, but we will not compare. We will not compare like, what is your standard salary? Actual, which one is less? That will not do it in the company. Now, and we will not take even interest also in this calculation. 18 lakh minus 7 lakh 20, you got 10 lakh 80. On that, what is the percentage tax? 31.2. This is 31.2 minus you got 7 lakh 43, 40. So, along with this, you have dividend distribution tax also. In case of company, there are two taxes will be there. One is normal tax, one more is dividend distribution tax. What is that? 20.55. So, this 20.55 divided by 120.44. Why? Because in this dividend is included. That's why we can divide by this is a standard percentage. It will be given in the question paper also. If possible, you can also remember. From this, you minus this, you will get 6,16,375. Hope you are clear. Yes. We'll go for individual Ram and Lakshman in case of company. In case of company, they are not partners, they are what? Directors. Yes. Now, so what is the actual? 3,60,000, 3,60,000. The salary part, 40,000, 40,000. Earlier it was 40, now you can make it to 50,000. Earlier it was 40, but in this exam, I have taken 40,000 here, but you can take it 50,000 standard deduction. This minus 50, this minus 50. Now you take it 40 only. Remember, this 40 you take it as 50,000. Do the further calculation. 3 lakh 20, 3 lakh 20. Calculate tax up to 2 lakh 50 nil. Balance 70,000, 5%. 1,040, 1,040, including education says. 3 lakh 20 minus 1,040, it will be 3 lakh 18,000, 3 lakh 18,000. Later, Go back, what is your answer? 6 lakh 16. Divide, it will be 3 lakh 8, 3 lakh 8. Total income is 6 lakh 27, 6 lakh 27. Hope you are clear. Yes. Now, standard deduction is 40, but you correct it as 50,000 is your standard deduction. Hope you are clear. It is revised this year. So, we are supposed to take 50,000 as your standard deduction. Now, the procedure is very simple. Firm versus company means calculate total income of firm, individual income of partners. Done. Calculate total income of company, individual income of director. Done. Now we have to compare. How do you compare? I'll show you. Tax liability of firm, tax liability of company. How do you ta calculate tax liability? I'll show you. I'll change the color actually. Remember, wherever I'll mention black, blue color, there is a tax liability. Partners, firm. Where do we have tax here? Anywhere tax? Yes. Tax and education says 2,62,80. We have 2,62,80 plus. Is there anywhere tax? Yes. 11,960, 11,960. Total, this is 2. This is 3, this is 1. In partnership, we get three types of tax. One is normal tax 2,62 plus 11,000 
plus 11,000. 72, 82, almost 90,000. Check. 2 like 86. Done. 1, 2, 3. Clear. Similarly, I'll go for company. Company, how many taxes are there? See, the tax number 1. Dividend distribution tax, tax number 2. And tax number 3, tax number 4. Wherever you have taxes, there are two statements are there. Everywhere you add taxes and write. Now, 3 lakh 36 plus 1 lakh 26 plus 1040 plus 1040. If you add everything, you will get 4 lakh 65. Now, if you go for partnership firm, you are supposed to pay only 2 lakh 86. If you go for a company, you are supposed to pay tax 4,65. Which one you prefer? Obviously, you will prefer partnership firm. Why? Because the tax burden will be less. Hope you are clear. This much only you are supposed to do. No changes in the format. Exactly same thing. Only numbers will change. Now, remember this. I will go back to all the previous slides so that you can take a screenshot. Problem number one, solution part, your solution part, this is company, solution part, solution part. So this is all about your today's session, hope you understood, please work out the exact problem at your home so that you will understand better.